Yo, what's up, guys? This is Mondito HD. This is gonna be a tutorial on Sony Vegas Pro 8. I think my first one on Sony Vegas Pro. And I'm just gonna show you guys how to do slow motion on it today. So just follow along, guys. Tell me in my comments if I'm going too fast in my tutorials or I'm going too slow or I'm just not doing it right. So I haven't done one for a while. My last one was like around in November of uh, 2010. So. Alright, let's get started. First, you want to open up your import of media, whatever clip you want to do. I don't game really. Yeah, I don't really game. I'm trying to sell my Xbox. And I actually film, so I'm going to film. I uh, wonder if my cousin will see this. Probably it's him getting, like, about to get hit in the back by a skater. Alright, so what you want to do, you want to drag it down to the video track. And then this is what I do. I make the make timeline bigger, sort of thing. Yeah, so you have more room to not more room, but like it's bigger, so you don't have to. I think. All right. So what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna play this. So I'll show you guys what I'm going. All right. You can't really see it because it's all like I don't know. Because it's you're I'm recording with Cam Studio, or whatever it's called. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna click on it or whatever and then go with your right key and then go wherever you wanna begin your uh, slowness, slow motion. Oh my bad. I'm gonna start mine about right here. So what you're gonna do once you get there, press S to split the video track into two videos. Well basically it's the same video, it's just split. Then, you're gonna do you're gonna uh hold control and drag the the picture or I mean not the picture the video of the one you want to make slow mo and drag it out uh depends how long it is the, the more longer the more slower but the more shorter the more faster so let's check this out ah uh, Looks pretty stupid. I'm gonna make it a little bit slower. So show him get a debt in the back. Alright, about there. It's about five seconds long, I guess. I don't know. Alright, so what I'm gonna do right there is basically it. So comment, rate, and subscribe. But, oh, wait, actually. I'm gonna show you guys how to render right now. My bad. Click the wrong thing. File. Go to render as. I actually. Alright, so what you wanna do? Go to save as type. Um, look for Windows Media Video 9. And go to custom. And then go to video rendering quality. You want it at best. Um, uh, yeah. For audio. You want the mode CBR format Windows Media Audio 9.2 and attributes 128 kbps. I don't even know what that's. And then 44 kilohertz something. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not really good at that stuff. But and then stereo AV CBR. And then you want to click on Video tab, put on CBR Windows Media Video 9, and then put an image size high definition high definition 1280 x 720. And that's how you put it in your settings, whatever. Then frame rate, FPS 29.970 NTSC, basically the only NTSC there is. Then you want to put your, you actually want to put your video smoothness all the way to sharp is 100. And then go to bit rate. Then uncheck everything besides internet LAN and make sure it's at 3M for MBPS. And then go to index summary. And you just keep that all the same. I don't have to do anything with that and then click OK. And then you're gonna to wanna to save it. Well, I already have a thing saved, so I'm not gonna save it just so that just save it and it'll finish rendering. That's pretty much so again comment, rate, like, and subscribe. And show your friends this tutorial so if they want to help or anything, if you film, you game or anything, actually it helps a lot. For me I like to make edits so it makes it pretty sick. So alright. Thanks.